our local heroes who may be down, but they are not out. The Massapequa Coast Little League team may have lost their first game in the Little League World Series, but they still have a chance to win it all. News 12's Caroline Flynn is in Massapequa with residents sharing Pequa positivity. Well, we are on the ball field at John Burns Park, and this is where the Massapequa Coast plays their games. It's also where their big first game of the Little League World Series was screened last night, and we learned the big screen. It's coming out onto the pitcher's mound once again tomorrow. The town of Oyster Bay confirming they'll be screening this next all-important game right here. Always, always positive. We go home from Massapequa. <laughs> Fans of the home team are not sweating last night's loss to Honolulu. Instead, they're focusing on what they hope will be a major comeback in tomorrow's double elimination tournament. Hey, listen, all they have to do is play ball. You know, I, I saw a lot of those kids last night. They had this going on. They got to have this right in the zone. Let the ball hit the bat. And then it all comes comes together. While winning would be wonderful, Coast fans say what getting this far has done in the community might be the most special part of all. Everything is up. The community is up. And everywhere you go, you talk about our children. Long Islanders have gone out of their way to creatively show their support. Check out this sand sculpture made by Tony Kusakanki at Tobey Beach. Oh, it's exciting in this town. I mean, the, the community, the, the loyalty and like the togetherness and you can feel the power. That's Daniela Buscaglia. She created the good luck pizza pie over at Carmela's of Massapequa. Hopefully it'll push them over the top. We'll see what happens. It's great that they made it in. I think it's it's wonderful. Just play your heart side. Good luck. We're all rooting for you. <laughs> you went back to Pika. You went back to Pika. Tomorrow's all important game begins at 2 o'clock. And if you want to watch that first pitch with the rest of the community, the town of Oyster Bay, they are bringing out the big screen once again to the pitcher's mound where these boys play all of their home games. We'll definitely get here early. And that's because the crowd only continues to grow at these watch parties as these boys advance further and further. In Massapequa Park, I'm Caroline Flynn.